200,000 people died after the recent Indonesian earthquake and subsequent tsunami or tidal waves simply because they had no warning. Earthquakes, like the disastrous one that devastated Kobe in 1995, hit without warning and are often followed by tsunami. There's a reason why tsunami is a Japanese word. This is one of the world's most earthquake-prone countries. Alerting the nation to earthquakes and tsunami is the job of the Japan Meteorological Agency. We have 180 seismometers around Japan, transmitting data 24 hours a day. Computer analysis of this data allows us to produce tsunami warnings very rapidly. Two minutes after an earthquake, the agency announces the intensity. Within three minutes, it issues provisional tsunami warnings. And within five minutes, comprehensive earthquake information lets people in coastal areas know if they need to evacuate. Just two seconds after seismic data reaches the agency, it is retransmitted to emergency services and broadcasting stations. Broadcast programming is immediately interrupted for emergency announcements. Specially designed equipment saves precious seconds when producing tsunami warnings. This touch screen automatically generates a graphic display of coastal danger zones. Incoming earthquake and tsunami data from the meteorological agency is directly displayed in an easy to read format for the announcer. It's very important for us to be able to get earthquake information and tsunami warnings on the air as fast as possible. If possible, within two minutes for earthquakes and three minutes for tsunami. In order to do that, we use the latest IT technology. And that enables us to carry out this public duty. The Meteorological Agency is currently experimenting with a faster emergency earthquake reporting system. As soon as the seismometer closest to the quake sends data, the system begins calculating probable intensities. The expanding red zone shows the estimated arrival time of large tremors. Earthquakes directly below cities are difficult to predict, but damage can be minimized if high-rise buildings and transportation authorities are alerted promptly. Another system now being tested uses terrestrial digital TV frequencies to broadcast emergency information to mobile phones. New technology with faster tsunami and earthquake warnings is saving lives.